chance to check out our starting lineups. First for the West All-Star, Chris Paul is out there with Harden. And the big fella inside out of the University of Kentucky, the unbelievably gifted and powerful pivot man, DeMarcus Cousins. And it's Durant, and it's Davis in at the four. And for the East, Kyrie Irving is out there with Paul George. And it's Andre Drummond at 6'11", 275 pounds, the big athletic presence out of the University of Connecticut inside his center. And it's LeBron James, and it's Gasol at the power forward position. Well, it never gets old to see the incredible talent on display here at All-Star Weekend. Yeah. This year is no different. Well, pretty much all of the events are a lot of fun to watch, and um, it's a combination of tremendous skill and entertainment. You can't beat it. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to tonight's broadcast of the NBA All-Star Game. Alongside Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr, this is Kevin Harlan. Well, we know basketball is a game that's all about team success and team achievement, even here in the NBA. But this game, the All-Star Game, gives a nod to the great individual talent. They get the rebound. Yeah, Drummond has explosive lift, and it's why he can go up and get so many shots defensively in terms of blocking the ball. People just don't expect him to get up as quickly as he does, but he is really bouncy for a big man. He is that. He's light on his feet, and he's very fast. I mean, just straight up running down the court, this guy gets up and down like a much smaller man, and I think he's got some real pages of history. Yeah, they're, they're really making their mark on this Sunday night, but at the same time, James Harden getting it to go from deep. And he gets it to go. Well, we've seen that before. These two know oh, what each other is thinking. Outside Durant. Good, and Paul gets the assist. Well, you know, he focused, and I know he's looking to continue that effort for the second half of the season as well. Well, as you'd expect, not every time the All-Star game comes to town. Cities buy to host a big show, and it's a big boon to the local economy. Yeah, restaurants, hotels, nightlife. It's, it's one big celebration, and there's always that buzz in the air every time the All-Stars gather to play. That's All-Stars shooting their first free throw attempt on the night. Date from the sidelines. Well, Tom Thibodeau gave me a few minutes to catch up with him. Talking to Coach, he said that this is one of the few times he's not had to worry about defense hitting into a game. Coach said, it's nice knowing that the more scoring there is, the better it is for the game. And the better it is for us, guys. It was great to hear from you, Doris. off with his release. That miss right there will definitely leave him shaking his head. And then Cousins with the dunk. Now, here is Irvin. He has six. There's the bucket. Good. Not enough defense there to throw him. And he gets it to go. That's the kind of defense required when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were right in his face. That's good. A large part of what they've been able to steal. And fouled as he went up to the dunk. Good aggressive move, and he'll shoot two. Good game for Irving. He already has ten points, and he's picked up six points from behind the arc. Now his outside stroke has looked really good today. Kevin Durant has set the bar pretty high with his scoring in All-Star game. He has averaged 30 points a game in his five appearances, and that's a good trophy. But uh, the big thing with Durant, like LeBron, they love the All-Star game. They love to, to, to compete and play against the best guys in the league. They're not looking for a night off. They're, they're looking to showcase their skill. Puts the lead pass in front of him. And that one's good. George. You know, something we're seeing. And Butler, here we go. That's his second foul already, and that's going to force him to, I think, tone it down a little bit at the defensive end. In a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the East All-Stars. you got to like the consistency they're showing with that mid-range shot. The other thing they've had going for them tonight is their passing. I mean, doing a nice job. Plenty of them coming up with steals at the moment a ball handler picks up his dribble and is getting into a shooting motion. He's got to. In terms of rebounding, it's been a sensational open. Oh, look out. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, he's giving the fans a show right now, Card, letting it loose on the rim that time. Yeah, you can't overlook the fact. Here's Harden on the wing. And a great assist by Paul as that one goes. But they recover it. Harris. And they convert it last on attempt number three. He's looking for Griffin and finds him. That is good. 
the aggressors, Clark, in getting the ball inside into that lane area. Now here's Rose, the fast break opportunity. And Wall with the slam. But that was like a body blow. Oh. That's good. The assist that time from Knight. Left here in the opening quarter. Curry, good. Down low. Here's Anthony. Terrific assist. Did it and then got back straight to the glass. Oh, and the jam by Butler. Well, Clark, uh, that one to the bucket. And Anthony sends it back. Wall. Shot is off. So the first quarter wraps up with some nice defense in this one. East All Stars ahead. They lead by eight and will return shortly. Welcome you back to the NBA All-Star Game as we get set to begin the second quarter. And Kevin, already some highlight real play. Yeah, they're playing at a nice tempo right now, Clark, giving the fans a show. Here's Kirk. play basketball but aside from that, we usually aren't going to see too many whistles. Well, Blake Griffin, the where to be found. The offensive rebound, and the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. That's some tenacity inside, battling for the second-chance points. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for the West. Eyes a three, and he gets it to go. Westbrook's got himself going there, his first point. Carter Williams with the buck. Carter Williams has got his first basket. And it's the Here's Westbrook. Takes the elbow jumper and trains it. Whatever they're playing with the ball. Here's Drummond. That's good. To Westbrook. Cousins. A follow-up champ. You know, he's really adept in for Eric Bloodsoe. Now here's Durant. And stolen by Kyrie Irving. That was really a gift there. A nice steal, but probably a pass that shouldn't have been made in the first place. Textbook example there of how to use defense. Irving against Westbrook. Drops in the layup for two. Westbrook's got his third bucket of the... LeBron dishes to Irving. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. Happening right now. Here comes Durant. Kevin Durant set the record with 30 points in three straight All-Star games in 2013. He made it four straight last year. Can he do it again this year? That's the question. On Durant's performance in last year's All-Star game. Probably his best yet. You know, if there's a player that's custom-made for an All-Star type game, it's Kevin Durant. I mean, he just loves to play. He's a free will. He scored out about 38 points, 10 boards, 6 assists. I don't know if he can take points for him. Paul kicks to Durant beyond the arc and a great assist by left side Irving George knocks down the three ball George has got seven and they wasted no time getting those three points back outside I mean textbook perfect good balance nice high release splash well, he earned that one, took the hit, and still found a way to knock it down. Yeah, fantastic body control. And the will to get it done. Now, here is Harden. He's got 11. They grabbed their own miss. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Chance here now for a three-point play. He's a grinder. He love what he does under the offensive boards, really bringing energy and life to his team. The West All-Stars have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. Getting back, being aggressive, attacking. Oh, 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 what a throw down there. Oh. Man. Boy, I tell you what, they might have to change out those rims after this one. <laughs> yeah, it's been an all-out from guys. They need him to start burying some of those. And he gets it to go. 19 points for Kyrie. Working on Drummond. Shoots a fader. And Cousins gets it to go. Cousins is here is Durant the drive by Cousins the basket good off the assist from Durant 
And now just a four-point East All-Star lead. George with the bucket. In the first, he had trouble hitting with any consistency. Side. You know, guys, if he does his work early, he knows when he gets in a good position, his size gives him a big edge on the glass. Well, this is how you completely rattle an opponent's rip. Yeah, you know, such terrific on-the-ball defense. No one near him. And the shot is good. Paul Irving dishes to LeBron. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Beautiful feed off the back. Low to Davis. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Davis has got nine points. Irving kicks to George. Buries it from three-point lane. 15 points in the game. Especially for the oh, oh, man, that was unreal. Mark it up. And here's LeBron. Oh, he got it. Oh, buzzer. Knock it down. <laughs> right at the horn. <laughs> and that is simply a dagger on the way to the locker room. That three-pointer feels like a six-pointer coming when it did right at the end of the half. So we've reached the end of the first half of play. East All-Stars lead by 11. We're going to step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. And we return to the NBA All-Star game. One half is in the books, and the second half about to begin. Yeah, and Kevin, often the second half is where you see that intensity turned up a bit. Well, yeah, the first half may be a little more loose, and then the second half is where it can get more competitive once the game is on the line. LeBron against Durant. All up top. And there's the whistle. Fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. Chris Paul selected to his eighth All-Star game. He missed the 2010 game due to injury. Arguably the greatest point guard in the league. He's a fixture in this game. And Paul always a dangerous ball. Never more so than in the get it again. Here's Drummond. It's good, and he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point snatched up. Here's Drummond. And the defense didn't have position. They whistle a blocking foul, and he'll go to the line. And he hasn't cashed in on his chances at the line, only making one free throw. And he makes the first, but misses the 10 footer. Good, and Paul gets the assist. He kicks it to Paul. Smooth as silk on the finger roll. Moving it up. George dishes to LeBron. So he gets the whistle, contact on the way up, and two shots coming up. Chris Paul picks up that one. The East All-Stars have made a little more than half their free throws today, 7 of 12. LeBron James has been an All-Star since his second season in the league, and this is his 11th straight All-Star appearance, and he always gets after it. Goes hard, even in the All-Star game. Now, here is Harden, 13 points in the game. The 11-footer, and misses it off the right side of the rim. Guys, some great passing from him. Yeah, it makes it tough for the defense to chase that ball around when it moves that crisply all over the cross the Hudson over in New Jersey. Plenty of friends and family in attendance. I'm sure he'll be as motivated as ever to put on a show. Love the bright lights. For three, Durant, and it's Davis point. Gasol is guarded by Davis. James. Good, he hits the jump shot. Six to shoot, and that one's good. He's got 15. Drop down. Oh, here's Harden. Throws it down as the official calls the foul. It may be a three-point play. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. They'd love to get more of those. The easiest the defense allows any more free runs to the hoop like that. And he gets it to go. The defense sagged off, and, you know, he did not hesitate to. Lock at six. A stupendous finish in traffic. Now here's Drummond. Following the miss by Anthony Davis. And by Anthony. Anthony's got his fourth rebound in this one. And there's Paul George. And the assist by Irving. It's Harden with the drive. And that one's good by Davis. His third rebound tonight. 
Steve, you talk about the starters and the reserves, unlike in regular games. In an all-star game, everyone gets a chance to play. Yeah, and I think the hardest part for the coaches, Kevin, is distributing those minutes because everybody is deserving. Everyone's a great player. And usually what happens is the Durant attacking and a great assist by Curry as that one sees. He's always going to make good on that. James. Lead back. Here's Durant. Makes it off the glass. Yeah, they're going to need some help. Here's Curry. And with that one, the lead is trimmed to single digits. Comes in. And that one's good. Irving back to Curry. Always going up. Watch out. <laughs> wow, that was unbelievable. How about that? Look at that. Well, not the... Passes it to Gasol. Goes back up. Yes. And it's Rose with the assist that time. He slipped into quite a funk here, Clark. I think that's a good word to describe it. I mean, the basket is looking awfully small to him at the moment. The West All-Stars have been at their finest four at the free throw line tonight. Eight attempts, eight makes. And he makes intensity start to ramp up a little bit. Yeah, I think so, Steve. A little more effort here as the game has progressed. The West All Stars have made a mistake at the line yet. 10 of 10. Kyrie Irving, he's checked in for Derrick Rose. Duran hits them both. Some great free throw shooting so far in this second half. They're perfect so far, so keep it up. And there's the foul. It goes on Jimmy Butler. That's his third foul so far. Bonus situation in effect, so we'll head to the free throw line for two. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. We're seeing today what makes him one of the best free throw shooters among the league's big men. Beautiful stroke. Paul, right side. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Side. And the rejection by LeBron. That evens the score. Side, George. And it would have counted had it fallen, but it's offline. Third quarter comes to a close, and a battle brings it to a tie. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get started for the fourth quarter. We've been having a great time here, and we hope you have been to the All-Star Game coverage continues. Thanks again for tuning in here to 2K Sports. Both teams put it on the show. Boy, it sure has been fun to watch, hasn't it? And it's the East All-Stars with the ball. The drive by Anthony. The shot goes in as the ref calls the blocking foul. He's on his way to the free throw line. Armello Anthony setting the record for three-pointers made in an All-Star game last year with eight. Steve, you called the game. You saw it firsthand on a very efficient 13 attempts. Well, he had 30 points on the night, a career high for him. And this is Anthony's eighth All-Star game, always one of the league's premier scores. He loves playing on All-Star Sunday. Yeah, and that's his first three and a half. Pass to Cousins. Good, and Curry gets the assist. 13 points for DeMarcus Cousins. In the Mecca. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Excellent night for Carmelo Anthony. He has nine points and one rejection in this game, too. And it was a good one, too. Really one of the highlights, I thought, of the game defensively. Both free throws, good from Anthony. And a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. That one's on Anthony. First one falls for him. Duran hits them both. He's simply just willing him. LeBron. Nailed from three-point land. And that's another assist for a team that is putting on the clinic on how to... Now, here's Durant. The turnaround, Jay. And Cousins gets it to go. And there's Paul George on the assist by Irving. That's 23 points for Paul George. Andre Drummond's checked in for Anthony. And it's Jimmy Butler coming in for Paul George. Harden inside the three-point line. The basket good off the assist from Durant. Durant. 
Oh, Drummond with a screen on Kirk. Irving, good. His work at the offensive end has been phenomenal. It's Harden with the drive. Tanked in off the glass. Harden's got 14 points here in the second half. He's on a ton to... Here's Curry. And he gets it to go. And now it's only a... And Curry with the clear path to the hoop. The big dunk at the end of the break. Yeah, boy, nice one-man fast break on that one. It sure was a stylish finish to cap it off, too. Three, good. These defenders are putting up very little resistance to the three points. 13 feet away. Good on the jump shot. Durant's got four points. This and that basket's going to count, folks. Gets the goaltending call right there. He thought he had that one clean, but the ref saw it differently. They'll count the bands. The shot by Curry. The basket good off the assist from Durant. Durant's got nine assists. They get it back. And Gasol gets it to go. They've been strong on the boards. There's no disputing that. That's what the box scores the contact, and he'll shoot two. Well, how about Anthony Davis in this one? 11 rebounds, and his two blocks have given them a lift defensively. Well, you have to protect the rim, Clark. You know that. And when you do that as well as he has today, it really bodes well for your team. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. Now here's LeBron. Soft touch off the glass. To take the lead. And the shot is good. Curry's got 11 points here in just the second half. Harden dishes to Curry. And the basket good. Now it's a three-point West All-Star lead. LeBron James on the win. And he gets the bucket. LeBron's got it. And loaded Davis. Yeah, he had not established position. You know, I prefer the refs to whistle with a block when in doubt. I thought that was a good call there. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the West All-Stars. Well, they're taking high percentage shots in the paint. I like the way their offense is clicking. It's been a hot shooting night for them, too. I mean, they've hit a lot. Offensive rebound. And Drummond kicks to Irving. Hands it from downtown. Irving's got six points in the quarter. That's just two of his last eight field goal attempts, so a difficult struggle for him here in the fourth. And the West All-Stars have possession. Now Curry. And Davis throws it down. Solid on the one-hand throw down there. You know, Clark, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Yep. Yeah, you got, you got that right, Kevin. He's such a reliable finisher. George, here we go. Paul George just hasn't slowed down. He has 23 points, and he's added to his numbers by hitting four shots from the three-point line. Well, 12 points from long range, so the defense has to figure out a way to defend him a little differently, try to get into his airspace. The West All-Stars making a switch here. Paul's checked in. Getting it done at the line, as he usually does. So, here's Durant. Good, and Paul gets the assist. 25 points for Kevin Durant. Boy, that was a big shot. And that one just flattened this crowd, Kevin. Yeah, nothing you can do as a fan after a shot like that. Just shake your head. On offense, here are the West All-Stars. Right side, Durant. Harden up top. He's covered by Irving. Durant. Off the left, rim and up. Clark, a critical possession right here. Boy, Kevin, you can just feel the crowd on all again. Irving tries from 10. Money! And tie game. That is a huge bet. Outside, George nails the triple. This is incredible. It's been a three-point barrage. Outside, George leads him in there. They foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Smart foul there. You've got to try to extend the game. Yeah, it's still close, but they're fighting that clock as much as the score right now. First free throw is good, and that gives them a four-point cushion. So it gets them both, and it's a five-point game. And that's exactly how you close the game out. 
Those free throws will bury him for sure. Here's Paul. So the East All-Stars win it. And Kevin, such amazing talent in the Eastern Conference this year. I had a feeling we might see them beat the West. And for me, it's always great to watch the best talent in the world go head-to-head, -head, no matter who wins. Well said, Clark, well said. And with that, we thank you for being with us. For Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr, this is Kevin Harlan saying we'll see you next time.